New to Sound Energy's Voluntary Green Power Program provides a way for homeowners and businesses to invest in renewable energy equal to the amount of electricity they use. The additional cost is just over a penny per kilowatt hour. For the average energy efficient household, using 800 kilowatt hours per month, buying into a green power program costs about $10 more per month on their electric bill. Here is a map of the leading green power purchasers among cities in our watershed, at least those served by Puget Sound Energy. The top city is Bellevue, with 26 commercial customers and 1,787 residential customers for a combined green power purchase of 24.1 million kilowatt hours. Second is Kent with 14.7 million green kilowatt hours. Third is Renton with 10.3 million. Kirkland has 8.9 million. Redmond has 6.2 million. Sixth is Mercer Island at 3.698 million kilowatt hours. Seventh is Issaquah at 3.694 million kilowatt hours. Kenmore comes in 8th at 2 million. Ninth is Bothell at 1.3 million. Tenth is Woodenville with 983,000 green kilowatt hours, followed by Medina with 840,000 and Maple Valley with 805,000. These numbers combined with the rest of Puget Sound Energy's green power customers within our watershed add up to about 93 million kilowatt hours. What about Seattle? Seattle businesses and homes get their electricity from Seattle City Light, not Puget Sound Energy. Seattle City Light has a long tradition of clean, renewable energy, beginning way back in 1905 with the construction of the first hydroelectric plant up near the headwaters of the Cedar River. A hundred years later, in 2005, Seattle City Light became the first utility in the nation to fully offset its carbon emissions and has maintained a net zero status ever since. Seattle City Light has a list of business customers participating in their green power program called Green Up. Here's the top 10 from that list. Number one, University of Washington, 14,956,000 green kilowatt hours. Number two, Seattle University, 2,541,600. Number three, Starbucks headquarters, 1,913,600. Four, King County Chinook Building, 1,533,153. Number five, Jackson Federal Building, 684,800. Six, Puget Consumer Co-op Natural Markets, 638,311. Seven, Rosetta Informatics, 496,000. Eight, Methune Architects, 489,600. Nine, Seattle Public Utilities, 460,128. And at number 10, Pagliacci Pizza, 430,000 green kilowatt hours. A pizza company? These guys must be really committed to being green. What's their phone number? Do they deliver? They probably use electric cars or bikes or something? The top 25 business customers with Seattle City Light amount to nearly 27 million kilowatt hours of green power purchases each year. The number combined with another 54 million from all of the other Seattle City Light customers, including homes, brings us to about 81 million. 81 million combined with 93 million from all of our other Puget Sound Energy cities and our grand total is 174 million kilowatt hours of green power for our watershed. Big numbers? Maybe. If we assume, however, that the average energy efficient household uses about 800 kilowatt hours per month or 9600 kilowatt hours per year, then 174 million kilowatt hours is enough to power about 18,000 homes. Yet there are 1.9 million people in our watershed, averaging four people per household, that's 475,000 households. What percentage is 18,000 homes out of 475,000? We are only about 3.7% green. Very light green. Green-ish.